Okay, so today uh, in this video, I'm going to highlight over one of the decks that you will be receiving. I did make a couple videos using a similar build, but with the Dusk and Furball. But this time, we will be, I will be running some PvP using both Reptiles. Uh, and this time, there will be two Barb Strikes, or Garish Worm. So, um, more poison applied. And then your front, front line will be... A poison plant so this deck is pretty strong against anything that's very tanky uh, a lot of the cards like garish worm it's bug um, and then applying poison it doesn't really really matter if you have that much shield so it's good against those kind of decks um, it is weak against anything with a good beast cards or mech or anything like that it really melts through it since um all three axes on your team will be pretty weak against them. I'm going to run it like this uh, since it will kind of um, decentralize the attack. Okay, so we're going to jump into a PvP match. Okay, so we're going against... Uh, a poison deck so he's running it's pretty similar the the uh, front tank plant is exactly same as ours his midline is dusk so it does have faster speed and it has cleanse scent so it's kind of pointless You're trying to put poison on him so you want to skip him and he has a, a backline dusk with fur ball or juggling balls which procs the poison multiple times so first turn, uh, generally first turn, you do want to skip until you have more cards. Um, I will apply one poison to uh, to the front plant. I, normally I will save up cards to use Smart Shot and target the mid-axi. But in this case, since his mid-axi has a cleanse, I won't be doing that. I'll just apply it to the front plant and try to kill him off as soon as possible. So he used three cards and applied poison on my backline reptile. I'll be applying two poison to him. Okay, so I'd love to use Barb Strike, but I can't really proc it right now since I don't since this card you need to chain it with another bug card. But I didn't draw any bug cards on my other two axes. So the draw is pretty bad. Uh, but it is what it is. It's okay. So this turn two, I will end up skipping. So he decided to use an October tree with disguise and a grass snake on his back axi. So he'll be getting some draw and energy from that. Okay. So here I'll be... Uh, I'll use it in the order of Barb Strike first, then Smart John, so it still targets the front plant tank, and then end it up with the Chomp, and then I'll target his furthest Axie by using these three cards. Okay, so this should apply some poison very nicely on the opponent's back lines. So the key to this deck is trying to keep all three alive, but at a very low HP. And uh, that way, you, uh, the opponent can't really draw all of his cards on one axi. And then you just kill them slowly by stacking up a lot of poison. Okay, so here... Again, the card draw isn't that ideal. I don't know why, but I'm not uh, drawing any of my Venom Sprays. I will just uh, go for this. So the opponent will steal one of my energy, but I will be able to steal it back. And this way, he did use a Yam, but I won't be stacking up too much poison, since I only attacked with my front plants. Okay, now I finally I'm drawing some uh, Venom Sprays. So I will apply some poison to the front plant, and then I'll apply more poison to his 
back uh, back line tusk and I will use one of these uh, surprise invasions it does extra damage to any um, target that is faster I'll only need one to kill him off so that, uh, that's the reason why I'm running these cards on a reptile the speeds are slower than dusk in general and I'll use an October treat to put some shield So this will finish off my plans. The October treat was a little bit of a waste here, but it doesn't really matter. Um, I've said this in my previous videos, but it, this deck isn't really that energy heavy. It's more about card draw and applying poison. Okay, so now I will actually start targeting the mid axi he hasn't used his cleanse scent at all so um let me think i'll do it like so so he used a smart shot i'm not too sure why he used that but he did so he's saving up a lot of cards on his um mid -axi. He will use Cleanse to just get rid of that stun again. But that does mean uh, he will be only using three cards this turn since he does have a stun. So I'm going to actually um, attack with this guy. Or we, we can try using Barb Strike on both axes and uh, proccing some poison. So yeah, he gets rid of his debuff. And this should kill off his plant. Like so. So I'm going to try to save up a little bit of energy to, to finish him off. But he might, he might use Sneaky Raid and Surprise Invasion. That will kill off uh, this guy, which isn't that great. He's at a low HP. So he decided to attack the front Dusk. So this is good. Uh, this means he doesn't have enough uh, cards and energy to kill off my uh, Axie in the back this turn. So let's hope he doesn't. He might use... Um, I think he'll use... Not too sure. I'm not too sure what he'll use. Okay, so he's going to finish off my front uh, midline but but that's okay I'll get some poison and extra damage in so this turn I'll put up as much shield as possible by doing it like like so So he uses cleanse, removes debuff, but he doesn't have enough damage output, so this is okay. So yeah, this was a pretty close game. Um, I think a lot of uh, going against a lot of poison decks is a little tricky, but if you just get the timing right and save your cards right, you will be able to win against them.